Morning folks, Robin here and today I'm going to take you on one of my favourite walks on the Pentland Hills which are just outside Edinburgh, so let's get going. So that's me just pretty much set off from the car park. I'm parked at Flotterston by the pub there and uh, the car park was actually getting busy already. Today is of course winter solstice, so it is the shortest day of the year. And as of tomorrow, we can start seeing the nights are drawn out again. There's five peaks on this route. So the first one, which I'm heading up now, is Turnhouse Hill. Then you've got Carnethy Hill. Then you've got the highest in the range, Scald Law. And then if you're feeling fit, there's two extra peaks at the back, East and West Kip, which you can add on as well. me at the top of Turnhouse Hill. Next objective there is Carnefi and then Scald Law that's in the cloud. This is the reason I didn't go up the highlands today because it was just maybe a low lying cloud all day so seems to be blown off though so hopefully by the time I get to the next one Scald Law will be clear. I'm barely over the 500 metre contour line and that's me in the cloud. See if I see photos on Instagram later in the highlands are stunning. I'll be raging. Well, this is the top of Carnethy Hill and I can see hee haw Jack McGraw. Meh, meh. You know impressed? Nah, I wouldn't be there. Right. Alright, so I'm at the Bialak between Carnefi Hill and Scald Law and this is where you can make a decision. You can go up Scald Law, come back down and uh, exit that way or you can just bail now if you wanted to or you can do Scald Law, push on and do East and West Kip as well. Now, I'm just hoping this cloud's going to clear because there is a bit of blue sky above us, so fingers crossed. If the cloud clears by the time I get up there, then I'll carry on. If not, I'll just come back down here and be all that way. So, uh, let's get cracking. It's a small world, I've just met one of my work colleagues, he's out for a donder as well and while I was talking to him the clouds start to lift so I think I'm going to get a view and there's the summit Just make out the route I've came along and up here. I'm going to get out of this wind, it's pretty cold. So, this is the top of West Kip, and you'll see what I mean. It's just a nice little narrow grassy ridge. Nothing too dodgy, of course, you could get down there if you want to. Even that side isn't too bad, but it's just nice. Saw's law. <laughs> it cleared up. Conditions have really improved that 
I'm actually tempted just to go up and do it all over again instead of doing the low level option because look at this there's Scald Law that I never got a view from there's Kenefe and uh, right into the guts there towards Alarmio it's looking really nice So I've came to a different little top here, I'm on South Black Hill and it's got this rather impressive big cairn it's huge it's obviously been a maybe a built up shelter but it's almost like this has been flattened I don't know if this is modern, I don't think it would be but it's huge Right, I'm going to head down towards the reservoirs uh, this also makes a good low level walk from Flotterston as well so I'll bring you back when I get down there Well Scald Law is up there and I came down here and this is us at the How this is a cracking house, it'd be great to live here It'd be pretty remote But yeah, you're only 20 minutes away from Edinburgh So it's not really that remote at all But uh, During the week when there's not many walkers here It'd be a great place it Looks like it's getting done up as well Imagine the parties you could have there No neighbours to noise up You'll remember from this morning I took the Scald Law route Well on the way back I came this way Which made that a really nice loop Really enjoyed that Anyway that's about all I've got time for I'm almost back at the car So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one Cheers!